Well, meanwhile, there is a look now, a new look at some of the destruction that is happening in Kiev. Aerial footage showing the city, uh, parts of it just uh, destroyed from some of the shelling. And many residents are having, obviously, to leave town. Look at these apartment buildings. It's unbelievable. And so this morning we're told that frequent shelling has been heard, although more distant in recent days. Uh, the loud thudding that can be hear heard, the air raid sirens that go off almost on a minute-by-minute -minute basis. Vladimir Putin is trying to control the talking points, banning media outlets from using the term war when talking about the ongoing attacks. At least two independent Russian news outlets that refuse to share his talking points have been forced off the air this morning. And in an effort to intimidate journalists, the Russian uh, parliament has just passed a new rule that uh, basically puts a 15-year prison sentence on anyone who reports, quote, fake news at least the way they view it. Guys. Those pictures. Uh, unbelievable, right? And it looks very residential, Ron. It I mean, really does. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I know they were talking about going after military targets. Those didn't look military to me. Not at all. Yeah. Not at all. And we've seen it in so many cities. All thank right, you, Ron, Ron. Thank you. Yeah, those images are just heartbreaking. So we continue to bring you the latest on the war in Ukraine as it develops. You can also follow the latest on Live Now from Fox. You just scan that QR code that you see there on your screen, and it will take you right to Live Now on Fox.